welcome back. Um, in this episode, uh, we will be finishing up the rail, hopefully. I've got tons of rails. I cleared out this entire area of iron and uh, brought home nine stacks and smelted them all. And I actually only took half of them, be or half of the, only turned half of them into rails because I was going to take all of them, but they were only half done. So I was like, all right, so I'll just take this and make some rails out of it. And then ended up filling up, filling up my inventory. So, um, instead I decided to just go with what I had, um, instead of getting rid of all these other things in my inventory to make space, because some things like the blocks, I w or the, uh, the blocks I wanted to keep just in case, and I wanted to keep things like, um, I wanted to take potions with me so I could run around, because if I'm going to be running back and forth, um, hello, <laughs> you know, I don't want to be doing it super slowly. So I brought a bunch of um, speed potions with me from those chests that I never really took anything from, from the potion chests, because this is the only time that I really use a potion. I don't want um, I don't want strength potions. I don't need them, but speed potions are useful. So, oh, what am I doing? <laughs> I didn't realize that I had crossed here. I thought I crossed somewhere else, apparently. Alright, and by crossed, I mean crossed the lava ocean. Nope, you're not supposed to turn. Alright, that works. For a second there, I was like, how is that working? They're not supposed to be able to turn and go up at the same time, but it wasn't turning and going up at the same time. It was turning into one that was going up, or turning towards one that was going up, I should say because that makes more sense. See, like, I can't go like this. doesn't work. But I can go like this and bring this one up one. Ow. Okay, I don't appreciate that. You stupid skeleton. I think the skeleton's dead. Okay... Here we go. Um, it's freaky dark over here. I don't like it. <laughs> Which I, I did bring some sticks, so I'm just gonna mine some coal real quick. Four, five, six. Oh, I've got the little. It's on my task, my hotbar, so I can just count it there. Um, because sixteen coal and sixteen sticks makes a stack of torches. So, I usually just make a stack at a time for ease, really. Does this work? Yeah. Alright, where am I going here? Oh yeah, because this area is not lit up enough. If I bring pigs in here, I'll get attacked by all sorts of things. So let's just light this area up. Do -do -do, do -do -do. I can't help but feel like I missed something really cool somewhere. <laughs> because I didn't spend a whole lot of time in that forest over that way. Um, you know, since I kind of went around that way, came back, and then just started going up that far wall. <laughs> Doesn't really matter much if I'm going at an angle here. Like, uh, I don't want to end up backtracking. Like, I accidentally did that over in the, um, over in the deserty area. I ended up bringing my cart back a bit because I brought it too far in one direction, and I don't like doing that. Um, so I'm just going to try to keep moving in this direction <laughs> um, at all times with the cart, just to avoid wasting rails. Because it took a long time to grind out all that iron, and I don't want to do it again. <laughs> 
Okay, where did my blocks go? Here we are. Light that up. Swap over to a new stack. Oop. This is my little home for a little bit there while I was running in terror from those spiders. That was fun. I wasn't expecting the spider spawners at all, so um, I am glad that that was like that was an interesting. It was fun because it was unexpected. Oh, okay. See, yeah, I already went past the. Um, oop, can't do that. I already went past the. Uh, I went too far to the left. Is what I'm trying to say here. I think I just blocked that skeleton's arrow with my uh, little stone wall there. And my diamond armor has started to break. Um, the helmet went first, and then the boots later. But that's alright, I don't really need it anymore. Um, and besides, it broke the the least important ones first, so... Um, I've still got most of the protection. Like, I've got about the same amount of protection as full iron armor right now. So it's not too much of a problem. Okay, you know, Skeleton, you're just... All you're doing is making me upset. And you don't want to do that, because all I'm going to do is kill you. Like, you know, normally I might have just let you go. But no, you're making me angry, and that means I have to kill you. Alright, that Skeleton's going to die from that Creeper. Hopefully. <laughs> creeper blew up, but it sounds like the Skeleton's just fine. These Creepers are the worst at killing their targets. I mean, they never kill skeletons. I don't think I've seen one skeleton die from a creeper so far in this entire map. Despite the fact that I've lured them into shooting um, at them, like, dozens of times. Okay, there's a bunch of mobs that way, so let's just not go that way. Bring these rails up here. There we go. Yeah, see. There's very few areas for them to spawn, so where they can spawn, they spawn in great numbers. In large numbers. Great numbers? Those numbers, they're so great. I love them. Okay, anyway. Uh, pretend that wasn't so creepy, because I didn't intend for it to be. Right by some lava. I didn't mean to go that far, but alright, we're good. Just ow! You little lava time. <laughs> There's a bunch of lava that way, so I figured no matter which way he goes, he's landing in lava. No, nope, you're just <sighs> him too. Really, really. I hate the lot of you. Your kind isn't welcome on this planet, buddy. Not at all. Get out. No, don't shoot at me. I said, get out, and you too. I mean, zombies are a little bit more cuddly than the skeletons are, but uh, they still make me angry. <laughs> Trying not to say bad words here. Okay, really? Just get. Die. Burn. Burn. Okay. I got him. <laughs> Light up this area. And keep moving. That makes me nervous. Oop. Oh, I didn't think that went down another one. Oh, well, it doesn't hurt to have an extra thing there. You know what would be awful? If Vex put um, gas spawners under the lava. Like, it doesn't need to be deep under the lava. It would just have to be, you know, a couple blocks under. And you'd have no way of getting to it. And uh, it would 
Uh -huh. And it would really mess you up because, you know, you couldn't get to it, so you'd have to just deal with it. <laughs> you know? Oh god, I hope he doesn't... Vex, don't listen to that. Dang you, stupid creeper! <laughs> now, I figured, now that I've said it, you know, of course it's going to happen. I really hope I wasn't the one to give him that idea. Because if I was, then that, that would be unfortunate, and I'm sure a lot of people would be very mad at me for it. <laughs> Um, I know Ethos working on a, a map, or at least he he said he was. I don't know if how that's. I don't know if that's still on, or I haven't heard anything about it in a while. Oh, jeez, I'm over. I gotta go. So, uh, I forget which part this is. Um, I'll see you in a second. All right, fantastic. I was thinking that that uh last recording wouldn't go through properly because um. I was up to uh, 11 minutes, so if not more, actually, I'm not sure. Um, anyway, I was over the 10 minutes that I normally allow myself, and I was pretty worried. But everything worked out fine. So, yeah, the mobs over here spawn like crazy. I shouldn't have lit up so much back there. Um, well, then again, I didn't really light up that much except for what I really needed to, so... Get away, zombie. I'm going to have to build a, a stairway thing up to the top. So, that might be a little boring. What am I doing? I'm wasting all of my cobble, that's what I'm doing. I don't need to, uh, I can just build on the wall here, like I'm doing now. I don't know why I was building up from the sides of the blocks. You know, I feel like once you've got, um, once you've gotten to the, oopsies, the, uh, victory pen, it just, I feel like it just gets a whole lot easier, because at this point, all I need to do is, you know, bring the rail up here. Wow, I had just enough cobblestone. Actually, I didn't have enough cobblestone. I need one more. <laughs> well, considering I, I messed up and went and put all those, used up all those extra blocks that I didn't have to down here. I would have had more than enough. Boop. Ah! <laughs> Boop. Ah! Yep. That's what I said. It doesn't look like there's anything actually in this building. It's just all freaking silverfish blocks. So I need to remember not to break that. Oopsies! Mm, how can I fix this? Mm. One more out. Here we go. Nope, still not. Here we go. That works. It's a bit of a workaround, but it works nonetheless. And then I just need to get them in here, which I can't actually build on that. So I will, there we go. Go like that, and then hopefully they'll just fall in. Oh, but they will take some damage from that, so. Let's, ow. Let's just, uh. Build our pigots a little. Way in. And now we just need to head back. I don't know if you guys want to see this or not. Me heading back. Um. I'll just assume that you don't because. I'll tell you right now what's going to happen. I'm going to drink this potion, and I'm going to sprint all the way back. <laughs> and uh, then I'm going to get there and start recording again. So I will be right back.
All right, guys, we're back. So I didn't run into much trouble on the way back. Nothing special at all, so I'm glad that I skipped it. See here, we've got the rest of the iron. 36, 37 in all of them. Um, so I, I ended up with almost a stack of rails left, so I used pretty much exactly as much as I needed, which is cool. Okay, out the door. Here we go. No, actually, I need more iron to make, like... See, I need ten mine carts for the piggets, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Sounds about right. Um, so I need ten for the piggets, at least one for the powered mine carts. Um, I didn't think this through. <laughs> Okay, what I need to do is go back and actually grab some more rails, because I need to try to get some pigs in these carts. Sorry, piggets. I don't really know why Vex called them piggets instead of pigs, but... Or piggies. But, you know, it's not my map. And it is a fun map, so... Okay, I'll just put that down. Uh, break this. And on my way, pigs. Okay, you get in the car. There you go. There's one down. Get in the car. Two. <laughs> go ahead, get in the car. Get in the car. No, don't push it back. <laughs> yep, in the car, buddy. In the car. Three. And you can die. You can die. You can die. You can die. <laughs> you can die. You can die. I don't want to deal with these other animals getting in the um, minecarts. Go ahead. Go on in. Go on. Oh, that one's in. Go ahead, piggy. Get in. One, two, three, four. Get in. There you go. Okay, we have four and five. <laughs> oh, get back on there. Okay. Piggy, I need you guys to listen to me. Oh, I know what I can do. Get, get, move. There we go. Okay, how many do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Did I count that right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, piggy. Piggy. Whoa. How did I get turned around like that? Okay, I know you're excited for this adventure, piggy. But you need to turn around. Before you get hurt. And here we go. I will, for now, remove that. Just so that they can pile up in here without all getting stuck and broken and whatever. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven piggets so far. Come on, piggets, let's go. Have fun in the in there. You're just gonna hit an end and bounce back, so I don't really know why I did that. Which means I need three more, and there's plenty of piggets in there. And you can die. <laughs> I almost feel bad for murdering all these sheep. Almost. Okay, and then what was I doing? Actually, I think I just wanted to make more space, which I already did, so... I don't know. Maybe there's something else that I wanted to, but I can't remember it right now. Okay, come on. Get on on there, piggy. No, you're supposed to get in the cart, piggy. Okay, really? Really, piggy? You need to go that way. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> that worked extremely well. Nope. Out of the block. Out of the... P 
pig. There you go. Get in. Why don't you just get in the freaking cart? Okay, I want to say that's... Yeah, I made 12 carts. So, okay, piggy. Alright, what I was going to do is make some wheat, but then I realized that, um... But then I forgot that I was going to make some wheat. And, uh, then I didn't. And there we go. All 10 piggets. So we'll just push them forward a little bit. Plug that up again. One, two, three, four, five, six. Si oh, sorry, lost count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And. Nine, ten. Alright. Now I need to head back here and hope that they don't, like, despawn or something. Well, or, actually, animals don't despawn anymore. So, we don't have that problem. Um. That away, that away. I'll take that with me just in case. Put that away. Keep it in these. Okay, and then let's see. I'll just grab this furnace and this furnace. And actually, I'll make one more minecart. Because I don't know how well this is going to work. So I, excuse me, you stupid skeleton, burn, oh, I'm over again, so uh, I'll be right back, alrighty. So what I'm going to try to do here is I, I'm hoping to get a minecart for me in there too so I can just lead the group of piggets. Um, I feel like that's a bad word. <laughs> it just, it, it sounds to me like a mixture of two not good words. I'll let you imagine which ones I'm talking about. Um, okay, I need you to back up. And, okay, I still want that there. Now, is it getting nighttime? No, we got plenty of time. Okay, so what I'm going to try to do is come back here, push these guys forward, and put those there. And then I think they go... Oh, jeez, is it going? It's going, oh no! <laughs> is that going to push all of them? It doesn't look like it. If it is, then that's cool. It just doesn't look like it is. And that's understandable because I, there's no rail for that thing to... Wow, I just jumped over that minecart. Um, there's no rail for the powered minecart to try to go over <laughs> once you get to here. So yeah, it's they all pushed forward because they had the um, pressure built up from... The, no, that's not what I wanted to do. And go. Did I stop the cards up here by putting a um, thing in the way? Whoa, how did I use up 24 coal? <laughs> I had 24 coal, and then I went and tried to power those minecarts and managed to lose all of it, apparently. Maybe I clicked 24 times? I don't know. Or 21 times? Whatever the point is, it's pushing along. So I need to get up here. 
and go ahead and where'd my cart go? Oh, I took it with me. Okay, so I need to push those guys back at all? No, I can't. No, no, stop. Dang it. <laughs> oh my god. Come on, guys. We can do this. This is an interesting aspect that I wouldn't have thought of. Where'd my cart go? Seriously, where'd my cart go? <laughs> Did some of the carts actually go this far? You can see the powered mine carts are just pushing through. Um, I don't know if two carts is better than one. <laughs> um, like if it's actually better than one or if it's just me imagining it. And those carts, these pigs are going flying. Oh, oh. Oh, jeez. Okay. Well, they seem to transfer energy perfectly fine between the carts. Because that other pig hit this one and he went flying. Well, to be fair, three pigs hit this one, and the one went flying. But see, if I leave those ones too far behind, then they'll stop moving because they'll get unloaded and won't follow me. They seem to be doing all right. Can I ride in these? No. Darn. <laughs> I don't know why I'd be able to. I was just hoping that I'd be able to hop in one and, <clears throat> and follow them along because, you know, I don't want to have to walk alongside them the whole way. I was hoping to just hop in a cart and go, but um, oh, what I should have done is, oh, but I didn't grab any of that redstone. See? That's where the redstone would have helped. I was going to say, I should have just grabbed a piston and put a cart... Uh, oh, but I didn't have any slime. Did I have slime balls? I may have been given slime balls in one of the things. Um, to make a sticky piston. But, you know, I don't even need a sticky piston. I just needed a regular piston. And I could have just pushed this off to the side, put, like, a, a track off to the side, and then pushed it into place with a piston to stop the... Because I needed a thing to stop the pigs from going, but... Okay, now we're going fast. And the powered carts don't speed up when they go downhill. Good to know. <laughs> powered carts are just lagging behind a little bit. On the right side, the pigs are going just fine. <laughs> so far behind. Come on, we can do it. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, oh, they started sliding back. <coughs> How many do we have here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so we're missing two that have presumably gone up ahead. Powered minecarts are chugging along. Um, I know Notch said he wanted to add something to... What? Why? Why? Why did a pig die? I don't know why that pig died. Okay. That's not normal. <laughs> nope. Wrong direction, buddy. Need to be going... This to nope, okay. Clearly that's the problem here. <laughs> Alright, can I push these guys? They need to stop taking damage right here. 
Why can't I push them? <laughs> okay, I don't know why they're going backwards now. <laughs> or, um... I don't... Yeah, we lost a pig. Alright. Um... That's unfortunate. I should have packed extra pigs. Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> oh, that sounds so weird. Yeah, see, without the powered minecarts, they just can't get up the hill. So, um, let's come back here. Oh my god, they just keep dying. And go. I don't know why they're taking damage there. And it seems like one cart just can't do it. So let's try two, see if it actually does help. Nope. Why can't we move, piggies? Here we go. Alright, we're still going. Still going. We're good. Um, let's see here. Up here. Oh, there's no mushrooms too. Alright. Come on, almost there. Just got it. Was that a skeleton that I heard? No. Apparently they can't go around corners very well. No, nope, pigs are dying again. Jeez. How do I stop that? Just grab these carts. I'll keep them as a tally of how many pigs have died. I don't know why they're taking damage like that. Whee! I'm glad I thought to make the powered minecarts, but... Alright, well, this is the end of this episode. I'll, I'll add an extra however long I have to to this episode until we finish. So, uh... Hold on just a second, and I'll be right back. Alrighty, we're back. Let's continue following these minecarts. So I'm gonna have to grab some more pigs. I don't know how many I lost because of that, uh... Stupid corner over there. It was really unfortunate. I don't I really don't know what happened there, I mean I don't know. Maybe there's just some bug about minecarts that I didn't know about. Where you can't ride around corners if you're being pushed by a powered minecart. Stupid zombie Zombie in a minecart. Zombie that's no, you're not supposed to do that. You're not supposed to do that. Get out of my minecart. <laughs> Stop harassing my pigs! I think that one actually ran out of fuel. Oh! No! No, pig. That's not what I wanted. Ow! That hurt. Ow! That hurt too. Ow! No, creeper! Okay, why are they going so far backwards? Stop it! Jesus, this is nothing but trouble! Go! No! <laughs> You're stupid! Okay. Put that in there. Um, yeah, just throw that on the ground. That works. I need to go back and grab some of that coal. Because I'll never be able to push these guys all the way up the hill. Like, I seriously think it's literally impossible for me to push them all the way up the hill, so... I'm going to have to run back and grab some coal. It should be right over this hill, though. So I'll grab, like, 16 or something. A decent amount. Oh, dear. There we go. Alrighty. Alrighty. 
So how are you? <laughs> I I'm liking this map. I this is an interesting uh, mechanic that I've got that he's got going on here with this last little bit where you've got nope nope get away from here wow that went far I'm thinking knockback has a randomness or has a random element to it um, because sometimes they go really far and sometimes they just don't go far at all so you know oh well anyway okay torch there pick up that how much do I have 17 more than enough all right so that should last me. Hopefully that'll take care of all of these pigs and the next set that I'm going to have to go grab because several of this one died. Um, I'll bring another ten pigs with me next time. Um, so that way I know that, or at least I'll count how many I brought here and how many survived, because if only like four survived out of the ten, then I'll have to bring more than ten, just to make sure that I get at least ten here when it's done. Looks like the zombie despawned, which is good, because something just fell in lava. <laughs> I heard it hiss. But anyway, um... So, come on. Come on, biggies, we can do this. Is that creeper still here? Yeah, I think that zombie despawned, because I believe it was in that cart right there. And it's not there anymore, so... I can't believe the freaking zombie got in the way. Yeah, see, I guess... I I don't y make use of powered minecarts very often. Um, so I guess... That's probably something I could benefit from. Um, go around the corner... And don't die... <laughs> It looks like some of them already made it up. Yep, some of them already made it up. Okay, we've got five. All right, can I? There you go. You can get out now. There you go. Uh, you two. And you three. Get out. There we go. Um, drop these spider eyes, drop these sticks, drop this string, oh, did I just pick up the spider eyes again? No? Yeah, yeah I did. Alright. And drop the raw beef, because I want these minecarts. And I'm going to need two more inventory spaces. So, drop rotten flesh, because i got plenty of food, and this iron ore. All right, so you guys stay. And actually, I might want to just do this so they can't get out. <laughs> um, because if they hop their way out, then I'm screwed and I have to bring them back again. <laughs> so, all right, we have one, two, three, four, five piggies. I'm going to, this time, bring... Um, I just want to make some tor- oh, you know what, I could have just gotten rid of those. Or that. Because I don't want either of those. But um, I do want to light this area up a little bit on the steps here. <laughs> or on the rails up here. Because um, I don't want another zombie spawning like that. Because <laughs> that was a little annoying. If you hadn't been able to tell by my reaction to it. Okay, you need to stop. Okie dokie. And there we go. Alright, so now I will hop in this minecart. <laughs> and, uh. No? What's wrong? Why isn't it going? It should be going. It should be all vroom vroom and just drive off. Oh, there we go. I will hop in this minecart and ride it home. So uh, I'll pause the recording and let you know when I'm there. Okay, guys. Um, <coughs> I had to let this pig spawn a little bit.
because they were, they were flat. There wasn't enough of them to um, to fill up ten carts with. one Sorry for not pausing there. <laughs> totally forgot about talking. It's a thing that people do with their mouth, right? You know, they just breathe out and, and make noise. Yeah. Yeah. Um, let's see. What to talk about? We've got four piggies. Five piggies. Um, on the way back, I... Six piggies. I went and took out any corners that might hurt the piggies. Seven piggies. Oh. Eight piggies. And nine piggies. Um, I took out any corners that might hurt the pigs. Um, so that wouldn't happen again. Is that ten? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Eh, whatever, it's close enough. Um, all right, now I will grab these for. It's too bad my carts don't stack. It's annoying me, actually. Okay, you guys go forward. And I've got some coal here. So power that one and power that one. And then they'll hit this spot here. Where I need to... Again? And the power minecarts aren't even moving. No. Not that direction. How far are these pigs gonna go? Because they bump into each other and apparently propel each other just fine. <laughs> um, oh, I've gotta pause the recording and I'll be back in a second. Alrighty, here we are once again. We've got our powered minecarts coming up from behind. You know what? Oh, screw that. I'll catch up to the minecarts and uh, put the powered minecarts back up once I get to them. Because this could be a long walk. <laughs> oh, oh. oh, sorry about that. <laughs> um, I don't know if you guys heard that or not. I put my mic up on accident. Um, but uh, if you did hear that, then I'm sorry because I'm going to repeat it. Um, I'm just going to catch up to the all the pigs first. And looks like I've hit the majority of them. And then I'm going to put the powered minecarts back down. At least one of them. And then it's going to go. I'm, I know this part is kind of boring, but I just wanted you guys to be there with me the whole time when I was bringing the pigs, at least. Um, like, it's one thing to just run back, but at this point, it's like I'm bringing the pigs because this is the... This is the goal that I'm supposed to get to, and, you know, my my role here is watchman. Just make sure the pigs get there safely, which I didn't do too well last time. And uh, it's not going so much better this time. Now, they'll get there eventually. I need to cross without hitting. I need to find the other pigs, because, obviously, 
this isn't all of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's almost all of them. But two or three carts managed to get pushed way ahead. So are they coming still? Yep, they're com are they coming? Yeah. The power bind cart seems to be just fine pushing them uphill. It's just around corners it has problems with. Because it's like when it goes around a corner, it normally it, the reason it pushes it doesn't have any special innate ability to push them, it just moves forward along the track. So when it hits a turn, it's pushing at a weird angle. Like it's trying to push straight forward, but the cart is supposed to be going left. Especially when it's going uphill like this. I shouldn't do that if I'm going to plan for powered minecarts. Um, which I, I now know, which is useful. Um, because the, when they try to push the carts up, they come this way and they have a hard time pushing them around corners, right? And then they're automatically pushing backwards because of the way the... Um, Okay, yeah, see, I, I messed something up there. This is why I'm staying back with the pigs, so I can make sure that if something happens, I'm here to fix it. <laughs> and um, something happened, apparently, up there that caused the this minecart to just crap out. Um, but yeah, the, the powered minecarts, all they do is just move forward. And what is happening here? Oh, there we go. That caused the minecart to crap out. <laughs> Actually, are they all just like stuck together now? Oh, you can see this is where I was um I was pulling out some cobblestone to make it so that the pigs wouldn't die on me again. Those pigs may very well just be like all clumped together and traveling at super high speeds together. What the why is there an empty cart? No. Stop it, pigs, get back here. No. <laughs> Don't you dare! Oh god. Oh dear god, what is happening? <laughs> Why? Why me? Not to mention there's skeletons hitting me in the back here. Yep, those are going to just keep going all the way back. Because for some reason they bugged out. So uh, I'm going to pause the recording and go get them. And then I'll be back. Okay, so I followed them back. And uh, two groups of two pigs went flying past me on my way back. So um, that doesn't seem to be much of a problem. I have an idea about what happened, though. Um, I think the pigs that got stuck together must have gotten out of my... Um, they must have gone into an unloaded chunk while they were riding the minecarts. So, um, as they were going along, they all hit the unloaded chunk and stopped moving. And they all happened to hit the unloaded chunk at the same point because they're all going on the same track. So, once the chunk became loaded, um, they were all in the same position. Meaning they all got trapped in that weird mess that they were in when I got there. And then when I tried to push them, they were all, like, stuck in each other and stuff, and, um, which caused them to accelerate much more than normal and go flying apart. So I'll probably have the same problem um, once I get over there again, but if I see a group of pigs mushed up like that, I'm going to take off a piece of this um, rail and replace it with cobblestone so it doesn't happen again <laughs> because I don't want this to um, keep happening this should be the last run hopefully I won't be heading back again um, I was gonna say I'll pause the video until I find one of the pigs but I seem to have found one of the pigs and they go pretty far by themselves um, like without any kind of propulsion merely because there is a pig in the minecart um, Apparently. I don't know, do pigs speed up minecarts when they're in them? Because that, that kind of seems like what's happening. And, nope, nope, mm -mm. nope, 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 you're going this way. Um, I know when they bump into each other, they give out a lot more speed than they had originally. So, um, making a long line of 
of pigs in minecarts makes whoa I thought I was gonna crash there for a second no where are you going oh dear god they're gonna go all the way back again this is just ridiculous is this another group of bugged out pigs over here oh my god <laughs> sprint I stopped it on the other side of the water, but that's not going to be good enough because they're going to go all the way over there. Like earlier, you saw, you saw me shooting at the pigs. I was hoping to catch one so that it would separate them, and then they'd all split up. But where the heck did they go? Weren't they just like right here a second ago? I thought I saw them. Maybe they're just all the way over here. Yep, these are the bugged out pigs. Oh, oh, there they go. Again. <sighs> this is stressful. <laughs> Once I get to the edge of this water, I'm going to put down another um, cobblestone block. I'm going to have to just do this like every couple chunks. Just like, you know, after a minute or so of running, I just, or not even a minute, just like every 30 seconds, put down another cobblestone block to keep them from doing that again. Like once I get out of the forest, I'll put down another one. Or uh, actually, I'll put one down right here. So that if they come down here, because they like to, apparently they speed up like a ton when they hit this thing. Just this little drop, and they go flying. So there's a spider jockey. That's not very safe for my pigs. Why can't I hit this guy? Here we go. Alright. Let's pretend we don't see that skeleton there. Is it nighttime? No, it's daytime. Okay, you're a douchebag. Whoa, lag! What What is that? All of a sudden, I'm just like getting these huge lag spikes here, and it's making me upset. No! Go that way. I don't know where these pigs keep flying back from. They just come out of nowhere and then shove all the pigs that I've got back all the way to the beginning. This is really getting upsetting. Did I just hear a creeper? Like, dying? No, get. Fortunately, I seem able to push pigs uh, while sprinting. <laughs> without stopping sprinting. Which is nice. Because I figured I'd hit them and stop. Like, you know, if you run into a wall, you stop, so... Okay. So I am expecting that bugged out group of pigs to come back soon. Alright, looks like this episode's gonna be an hour long because I've gotta get another 10 minute section um, done here, so uh, I'll be right back. <laughs> Alrighty, so hopefully this will be the last um, 10 minute segment of this episode. Because this last episode is going to be like an hour long. And I hope you guys enjoy uh, watching this because it's fun to make. But I, I just worry that, you know, pushing pigs around isn't the most entertaining thing in the world. Um, <clears throat> but nonetheless, you know, that's what we're doing. So, let's stick another one there. Keep them from falling back down. It's so weird because um, I can see the the blue light from the sky in the distance, but um, it's actually really dark here, so, like, no matter what I were to, like, I don't know, <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about, nope, nope, go up, okay, now I need to do this, and why am I missing one? I'm missing a, uh, no. there we go, and go.
because I can't push them up the hill. So I need the uh, the powered minecart. Is there coal over here somewhere? Because I know that's not going to last all the way to the end. Can I power it with bowls? <laughs> <coughs> That'd be funny. Just stick a bowl in every couple minutes. Burn that instead. Well, that's where it went. And it's clogging up the line, too. Because those things are hard to push for some reason, even when they're unpowered. Or, well, not even, I, I shouldn't say that, not when they're unpowered, it's just sometimes they can be hard to push. And Oh, there's the super pig clump. So, I take it that means this thing's done now? Yep, this one's done. Just because it hit the super pig clump. Stick that there. Now hopefully the super pig clump will uh, stop moving. Stop moving. Go forward. Not backward. Okay, we're good. Um, hopefully that clump of super pig, or that super pig clump, I don't know what to call it, will uh, get all the way to the end by itself now because we're closer than we were before. Um, so it should just keep going, but you never know. I'm doing it at the top of the hill, because that way if they get all the way up there, and then they turn, and then they hit the thing, they'll bounce back and continue going this direction again. Come on, piggies, don't fail me. Dang it! You, I blame you. Yeah, see, it'll get all the way up there and then roll back down. I'm glad I put that down because it saved me the trouble of having to push them all the way back up, up the hill and then back down again. And okay, I think the pig got back down here again. Let's stop it here. Let's see. Keep going, keep going. No. Wrong direction, buddy. Oh, jeez, you almost pushed me into lava, you little... <clears throat> Okay, these guys need a powered minecart, because I clearly can't push them past something here. There's just something where they they go up, and then they come back down, and uh, then they... No! Okay, really? Oh my god. Okay. Because so I need a little walkway. So I can get behind these guys without fear of falling off. If that skeleton wasn't there, I would have been perfectly fine. But I couldn't just leave him because I don't want him to shoot one of the pigs and let him out or kill them. I mean, I know that I have more than I need right now. No! Oh my god! Okay. Grab some coal. Because I didn't want to have to put the powered minecarts down, because that would mean um, they'd have to go around all these corners. But, um... I can't do this by myself. So, or I can, it just won't let me. <laughs> like, it's not like I can't push them up this hill. Because I can... It's just that they keep um, the top ones go forward and then come back down. And actually, I wonder if using this thing will be... You know, just go. <laughs> just go. Do it yourself. Not put up with any more of your crap. No, actually, I'm just going to do that, because I don't know if that'll bug out or not. Because I know there's bugs where minecarts go through blocks sometimes, um, like if they're going up or down. So I'm just going to try to avoid that at all costs. Okay, nope. 
Just because you don't want to go anymore doesn't mean you can just turn around. Just ask for some help, and I'll push him up the hill for long enough, or long enough for you to come in and start pushing them yourself. There we go. It's another zombie. I hate zombies. Nope. Again, you can't just crap out on me. You gotta keep going. Oh. No. Damn it. You little... <sighs> I hate those pigs. How have they not reached the end yet? Oh, my God. And now a pig is loose. Where'd he go? Just get up the hill! Go! Oh my god! You, get back over there! Get over there! <sighs> Stop it! Stop fighting me on this! I'm trying to bring you to a very nice, happy place! Oh my god. Okay. Now get up the hill. Why is there no track there? Did I remove the track there? Okay. Oh, I think I was trying to put something there when I accidentally jumped into the minecart. Because, yeah, jumping in a minecart with a pig in it knocks the pig out. So he can just wander off if he chooses. Oh, God. That scared the crap out of me. There was no warning for that. It just flew out of nowhere. Okay, somehow, this pig got derailed. And so did that one. What the heck happened over here? Alright. Okay. Get one of these down. Go. Yep, nope, I'm going to have to make another 10 minute segment here. This is going to be over an hour long. Well, I don't mind. I just hope you guys don't mind. Get down there. God. Seriously, I hate skeletons. <laughs> They're just the worst thing ever. Why can't you push that thing up? You're just going up a slope here. Okay. I think we're pretty much almost done. <laughs> so, let's see how this goes. Let's hope none of them got derailed off the side of the lava here. Because that would be unfortunate. I don't want to lose it. Nope. <laughs> you ain't getting back. <laughs> Okie dokie, let's go. I don't know if this minecart is still powered or not, but uh, I've just put in another coal. Alright, so I'm going to pause the video and start up the next section of this recording, so I'll be right back. And here we go again, for one last time, hopefully. <clears throat> and I will be doing more of Vex's maps. Um, at least one. <laughs> um, he's putting out a new one on the 20th of December, which is this month, if you're watching this when it comes out, um, or soon after. Uh, so, we should expect... N keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going! Don't blow up! Don't blow up! Okay, we're good. We're good. It's all good. No big deal. No! Don't! No. 
Keep going. Keep going. Good. All good. Good here. Keep going. Just, just keep pushing up. No, no. I don't know how to stop this. <laughs> Apparently that's how you stop that. No, no, not what I wanted. Get in the cart. Get in the cart. There you go. Now go up. Up. Up, up. Nope. Nope. I said up. Stop pushing me off. <laughs> Jeez, these guys fight back. Okay. Come on. We're almost there, guys. Almost there. Okay. Whew. That was rough. Oh, oh, they stacked. <laughs> Alright, it looks like I can break these without killing the pigs. Or injuring the pigs, at least. Okay. So. Let's, uh, count our piggets here. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14? Did I count right? Uh, let's see. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Yeah. 14. We only needed 10, but uh, we've got 14, so. <laughs> Yay! What's under here? Nothing. Pretend I didn't break that. Just wanted to see if there was anything, like a secret under there. Because I do that. Anyway, so uh, we're done here. That's That was the whole map. And it was a great map. I thought it was fun. I didn't have a whole lot of fun having to deal with those uh, powered uh, carts. But aside from that, it was a great map. I thought it was really pretty and um, really nice. Well built. Um, I liked the progression, how it started out from the big open area to a forest to um, a dark forest to what seemed to be a desert strip. Um, and then big stone area with lava, and then big obsidian area with lava. I think it just really suits the, um, you know, progression. Yeah. Um, I think the, the, this whole thing being made of, uh, those guys, little excessive, but... Uh, you know, <laughs> oh well. Um, because that, that almost seems pointless. I mean, they didn't do any damage, so all they did really was shove me around, and, um, and at that, it was almost pointless. You know, I just killed them in one hit anyway, especially with the sword he gave me, which was awesome. I mean, I'm sure this map is supposed to be easy, since it is just an experiment with the whole, um, capture the piggies. <laughs> I don't know what else to call it. Um, so, you know, I think it, it went pretty well for a first map like this. Um, Vex is obviously a great map designer, so, um, we have him to thank for such a nice map. And let's see, so this will be episode 7, which is going to be like an hour long. So, that means we've spent three, four hours playing this in total. I think that's pretty good for a map. Yeah? How about you guys? You think that's good? You think you? Yeah? No? Yeah? You How about you? You? You think that's good? Yeah? Okay. Well, the pigs agree. They think it's nice. And why wouldn't they? I mean, this is a very nice place for them to stay. I all I got was a little hut out by some mountains, and they get a freaking tower. And a person to bring them to it. So, you know. Anyway, um, there's another silverfish somewhere. I can hear it. I wonder if it's, like, inside here somewhere. Oh, well, I'm not looking for it. But yeah, so this is, a. Uh, am just... <laughs> I don't have any big finale thing, so, um... I'm just trying to talk about the map and how awesome it was. Wow, I managed to come out of that with my diamond pick just barely surviving. 
like one oh no I'm not gonna try to mine stuff two three four five apparently I am gonna try to mine stuff yeah see if you leave a little block there for the pigs to get up they will get up but yeah um so let me know what you guys think about this obviously like I said I'm gonna be um doing another one of Vex's maps I'm not sure which one right now um I want to say Sea of Flame, but I might just wait for the new one that's coming out, because that seems like it'd be fun, depending on how difficult it's supposed to be. Because if it's supposed to be one of the ROM hack ones, then, uh, no, not happening. <laughs> but, uh, if it's, like, normal or easy or something, then I might try it. Or, I'll, I'll definitely try it. Um, if it is a really hard one, then I might just pick up Sea of Flame and, uh, play that one instead. So, yep. Let's see, can I survive this fall? Probably not. Nope. Yay! That's my score. How many times did I die throughout this? I don't know, I didn't count. Somebody let me know how many times I died. <laughs> Back home. With the piggy's original home. Alright, so uh, I guess I'll end this here. Because uh, there's not really much left for me to do. Um... Yeah, let me know what you thought of this whole thing. Um, I haven't actually posted any of them yet, so they'll be up shortly. Or some of them will, at least. I don't know if I'm going to post them all at once, because I just feel like that'd be a little anticlimactic. <laughs> um, and encouraging, a, and that would just pretty much encourage a good, you know, four-hour video-watching session, which I don't know if I want to do. Because, you know, you should get up once in a while. I don't, but that doesn't mean you can't. So, um, yeah. So thanks for watching. And uh, this has been, uh, what was it? Pigot Panic by Vex. And uh, I'll have the link to the map and his, um, his forum page in all of the descriptions of these videos. So um, if you haven't already checked it out, you should check it out. Um because he does make great maps. And, uh, yeah. So, that's that's it. I, I, I hesitate to end this adventure that we've had, because it's been fun. I liked it. Um, I, of, between this and Capture the, or, I keep thinking Capture the Monument, because it's CTM for Complete the Monument, um, is what he normally calls his other maps. And, uh, I keep wanting to think CTF for Capture the Flag, so I just read it as Capture the Monument, and that's just not right. But um, I do prefer the the CTM maps, just because there's more goals. It's like, it's not just one big goal, it's a bunch of little ones that are... And you know what I mean? It's just, it's... It gives more reasons to keep going, like, to go to different places. Here, it's like, I knew that I was looking for one thing, and once I realized it wasn't in the nether, or, I knew it wasn't in the nether, so when I went in the nether, I was like, well, this is weird, so I'm leaving. And then, you know, I wandered over there, and I was like, well, this isn't it, so I left, and, you know, so the capture the... complete the monument um, maps just have a, a better sense of, okay, I need to go to this place, and this place, and this place, and... You know what I mean? I don't know. I don't even know what I mean. So, yep. Anyway, uh, I guess that's all. So, uh, I'll start uploading these as soon as possible. And uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.